so I have only been recently served a drink, and I am just tired from walking to this new town. So Creed's turn was almost overwhelming, and your turn is is underwhelming. Some, somewhat underwhelming. Don't think like that. All right. I wish to tend to my milk. All right, and now, <laughs> and now off to uh, Caradon, who is also in the tavern, in the corner. You are you were the worn uh, human that I was describing. Awesome. Okay. Kind of weathered right. human. So yeah. I'm gonna start. I'm gonna start my turn with a perception check. All right. All right. So I got a roll. All right. <laughs> Let's see. Seven plus. Eleven. Eighteen. Your perception check is eleven. Yeah. Shit. Nice. Um, you notice everything that I've said to uh, everybody else. You notice the Warforged, obviously. He, you noticed him <laughs> when you walked in. Uh, the Pixie, you notice. Um, you see the Dog Man lapping from a bowl. Dog Man. <laughs> okay. Uh, and you see um, a mysterious uh, person in the corner opposite to you, who's kind of surveying the uh, the tavern, who is wearing a hooded cloak and has a mask over his face. All right, uh, I uh, approach the pixie. Okay. And I, uh, <coughs> hi there. Oh, hello. I'm looking for someone. Oh, what a coincidence! I'm looking for my children. I'm looking for a changeling. Do you a have changeling? to know? Hmm. I just got into town myself, and I haven't seen any changelings. Wait a moment, I did remember seeing one meandering through town. Hmm. Did you speak with her? I did not, I came straight here. Hmm. How would you describe her? Um... She seemed lost in thought. Aaron, what's your character wearing? Um, Aaron is taking on the form of a human, so you actually would have recognized her as a human unless you made a deliberate perception check to figure out if she was a changeling. Oops. <laughs> um, so... Um, if I guess you, I should rephrase that, huh? Uh, you, would have, you would have seen a human, so no, you have not seen any changelings. Okay. Let me rephrase that then. Okay. I didn't see any changeling, but there was this weird lady wandering through town. Hmm. Thank you very much. You've been helpful. You're welcome. Bartender? Yes. <laughs> All right. How about you, kind sir? Have you seen any changeling around here? These parts? I wouldn't be able to tell a changeling from any other race to be uh, to be perfectly honest with you. <clears throat> I don't have the eye for that. <laughs> Do you have anything to eat? Oh uh, yes. Yeah, they have a uh, no oil. Uh, no, they don't have oil. They have mutton, ham, um, they have a, they do have horse meat, they have, uh, beef, you know, uh, mostly meats. They do ha they don't seem to have salad, um, but they do have some fruits as well. Hmm. Okay, no thanks. Uh, and then... Thank you anyway, sir. And then I walk out of the tavern. Alright. Um, and now we move to... Uh, kind of like the NPC round. Um, where if you guys had, had interacted with any NPCs, they might, do, they might do something. Um, okay. People who are still in the tavern notice the guy in uh, the uh, hooded yeah. cloak. Uh, stand up, and he walks over to uh, Anubis. Oh, and God. 
uh, he uh, holds out his hand. He says, uh, and he asks, "May I talk to you in the other room?" <laughs> that sounds so, like a sexual deviant. I, I don't know about it. You matter. You don't have a penis. <laughs> I have a cockpit. God damn it! I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna lie, that's pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> okay, go ahead. I have something important I'd like to discuss with you. I'm sorry. I'm doing Lelouch voice. I can't stand it. What would you want with someone like me? Explain yourself. I have a crisis on my hands that might uh, need help with someone of your talents. You call me fat? <laughs> <laughs> okay, seriously. <laughs> seriously. <clears throat> Sounds amusing. Alright. Sounds fine. Let's go. He leads you over into um, one of the uh, the second story <clears throat> rooms and uh, without even having to roll you notice uh, immediately that uh, uh, his mask is rather uh, unique it's almost like it's just a uh, um, a slightly curved white mask and it only has one uh, opening for his uh, for uh, his eye um and uh, he sits down, and he says, and he uh, uh, says, <coughs> um, uh, how much would it take, or how much would it take to pay you to keep a secret? What kind of secret are we talking? <laughs> Kree's good at this. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. Politics. Oh no, politics ain't my thing. <laughs> I'll, I'll be right back. <laughs> I don't require money. I just wish to test my skills. I can assure sure, you... Sure. <laughs> I can assure <laughs> you that as soon as we catch the culprits of this crime, you'll be able to test your skill as much as you want. You see, he takes off his mask, and underneath it you uh, see the face of a, a pale human, uh, humanoid. Um, but right before your eyes, his face morphs into a face that resembles yours. And uh, wearing your face, he says, uh, I'm one of the masked lords of Waterdeep. And then we'll get back to that. Ooh. Holy shit. Now we go back. <laughs> and I know nobody knows what Waterdeep is, but... Yeah. Uh, now we move on back to Lady Iris, who is following... Uh, Splitania. <laughs> so you two, so you two can actually, you two can actually take your turn at the same time. Because you're kind of okay. travel, you're traveling together. <coughs> so what do you guys want to um, do? While we're walking, I poke her in the back. Where exactly are we going? <laughs> <clears throat> I continue to walk without turning, uh, turning back. Saying, I said already, we're going to the tavern. I need to relax after work. <laughs> Alright, sounds good. And I will start walking up beside you. What are we going to do after that, though? I kind of want to keep looking around afterwards. <laughs> I, uh, I glance over to her and state, you're not, yeah, you're not bound to me. You can do whatever you please. I smirk. I know that. I just like bugging you for a while. And then I punch her in the arm. <laughs> oh my god. Are you guys like best friends? <laughs> 
jeez. Um, upon doing so, as you make contact with her arm, um, your fist uh, burns a little bit. Ooh. Ow. <laughs> she's a, um, she's, an, she's, she's a fire genasi. No, I can imagine the state of my clients. <laughs> so I look at my fist and I'm like in pain. Um, it's Ow. a slight burn. It doesn't. It doesn't do any okay. health damage, but it I does it kind of hurt. Okay. It does kind of hurt. Okay. I withdraw my hand. I look at my fist. Ah, oh, shit. <laughs> shit. Shit. <laughs> I stop and turn to her and say, "Please, don't touch me." Again, I, I advise. Again, I advise you to um, to be on your way. I stare at her, and my smile fades. <clears throat> Alright, fine, be that way. And I walk in the opposite direction. <laughs> Aww. Yeah. I thought you were best friends. Jeez, there goes the relationship points. <laughs> Back. <laughs> they just broke up. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Um, we Amanda. broke up. Wait, what? Yeah. Amanda's character broke up with Aaron's character. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> my keyboard. Jeez. <laughs> she has the fire and drink. <laughs> that was a short relationship. <laughs> our, les our lesbian OTP. No. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. So I sneer and continue to the cavern. Okay. Um, cavern? Tavern. Did I say cavern? <laughs> you said cavern. <laughs> Find yourself in a strange dark place. <laughs> <laughs> your water <laughs> dripping off in the distance. <laughs> uh, you're outside the tavern. You notice um, a, a a kind of weathered human standing outside uh, the doors of the tavern. Um, I I confront the man. Because he's standing in the way. <laughs> oh <my God. laughs> Are you gonna stand there all day? I need a drink. All right. I'm assuming this is me. Yes. Yep. All right. Um. <laughs> Pardon. Uh, may I ask you something? I suppose so. <coughs> I'm looking for someone. A changeling. It would be difficult to recognize with the naked eye. Have you seen anyone walk through these parts? Listen, the only people I've seen are my clients today. <laughs> <laughs> Sassy. <laughs> <laughs> None of which are, are, are of this changeling race that you speak of. Hmm. Very well, then. May I ask you one more thing? Okay, make it quick. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> what are you? What, what, what am I? <laughs> you're, you're, you're a being of fire right now, so yes, he's going to be slightly confused. Oh, okay, now you're standing yeah, in front of him. It's, that's actually very good. Staying in character. That was actually very good. Um, what, what, what am I? <laughs> <laughs> what, 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 It's none of your concern. Please, just leave me be. <laughs> very well, then. Thank you for your time. I... He moves out of the way and allows you to step inside the tavern. And I continue inside the tavern. Okay. Now, uh, Chiyoko, you notice this... You notice this uh, female creature that seems to be giving off light from her skin enter the tavern. And uh, you also notice that the uh, Warforge was just taken away, taken away by the man wearing the mask. <coughs> Now what? Oh, 